Brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Hi, I'm Mike from 1A Auto. I hope this how-to video helps you out. And next time you need parts for your vehicle, think of 1AAuto.com. Thanks. In this video, we show you how to remove and reinstall the front door panel. We show you the driver's side. Passenger side is pretty much the same uh, procedure. The only tools you'll need are a flat blade screwdriver and a Phillips screwdriver. Start by using a flat blade screwdriver and you can pry out on the outer panel of the door pull. You see these clips that hold it in, they just pull right out. And now you can remove the inner panel by removing six screws, three small ones there, a larger one there, another small one there, and a larger one there. Okay, we're just going to fast forward uh, as we remove all those screws. Use a flat blade screwdriver again and pry on the uh, panel that's right behind the door handle and that comes out. And in behind there, there are uh, two more Phillips screws. And we'll fast forward here again as we remove those two screws. And you do have to push in quite hard, um, keep the screwdriver in the screw to get it started. And now you can pull on that upper panel and it unclips from the door panel and then unclip all your accessories in the back power door locks, power windows, power mirror, etc. and usually they just have a tab that you press and pull the connector off. Now up at the top corner you want to pull on that trim panel and it pulls right off. Start at the top corner of the door panel, pull firmly, and there are just a series of clips around the outer edge of the door panel that hold it into the door. You kind of work your hand to each clip and pull firmly, and they release, and then you can lift the door panel up and off. And installing the door panel is a reverse of the procedure. There are clips on the panel that go around the outside, so you want to first Make sure the, all your harnesses come through, hang the door panel up, and make sure it goes down um, on the ledge, the window ledge, and then just set the clips by using the back of your fist, your palm. Okay, speed things up a little bit here. Take your um, accessory panel and make sure you clip all your accessories into place, power door locks, windows, uh, mirror, and then line it up on the door and clip it into place. Replace the two Phillips screws that are in behind uh, the door handle and then put the trim bezel back on and clip it into place. Yeah, put the trim panel back in place just by putting the pad in at the bottom and pressing it in. And we'll speed up here again as we put the uh, bracket in place um, that is the door pull and then holds the other a piece of outer trim and if you're just uh, taking your door handle door panel on and off you probably don't need to remove all the small screws uh, you probably just needed to remove the two big ones um, but yeah, this is the way we did it this time and we're putting those large screws back in place and then put all the other small screws back in place to hold it all together and last but not least snap that upper panel back in place we hope this helps you out Brought to you by www.1aauto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Please feel free to call us toll free 888-844-3393. We're the company that's here for you on the internet and in person.